Hey guys, what's up? So today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how I uh, fixed the multimedia keys not responding for me, such as the volume keys. And I'm going to show you what I mean by that. So on my keyboard, when I press volume on F1 or F2, F3, it should do this. Like it should move the volume up and down, right? Just by pressing the volume buttons. But um, sometimes what happens is the function key gets locked or unlocked so it doesn't respond like that so this is what i want to be able to do press volume up it goes up volume down it goes down i press volume mute mutes it you know what i mean but sometimes it gets locked up and it won't react the way you want it to and the reason it does that is by accident you might click function so if you hold function on your keyboard next to like where the space bar is and then press escape at the top where the lock is hold that for like a second, let go. Now, if you press those keys, the volume key, it does nothing. If I open up Google, for example, and I press uh, F3, which is volume up, it opens up that search thing, right? Which is not what we want. If I press F2, it doesn't do anything. If I press F1, it opens up a new tab. So that's not what we wanna do. The only way that you could get it working, if it's in this case, is you would have to hold down function and then press F3. You see what I mean? Or hold function and press F2. And I don't want to be having to hold down function when I just want to like use the multimedia key. So what I do is I press function and escape on the keyboard, let go. And now when I press just F3 by itself without the function key being held down, it responds how I want it to respond. So I hope that helps you guys out. Um, I'm on a Dell laptop, so I don't know how it works on other laptops, if there's a difference. But um, the secret for this Dell laptop is function and the escape key to like toggle on, toggle off the function keys slash multimedia keys, depending on how you want them to uh, work. Now, another way that I saw, I'm going to show you, I'm not going to do it because it's not even visible for me, but... Supposedly, you can type in control panel, click on that, and here if your view is in category, it might look like that. So you would click on large icons and go down to uh, Windows Mobility Center. And when you click that, you have these options here. Now, there should be another option for you to like scroll down a little, and it should have a... Uh, According to people, like some people have it, I don't have it as you can see, but there should be an option there where you can switch the function key and multimedia keys and all of that. So if you don't have that, like I don't have it, try function and escape key. Um, if that doesn't work, you would probably have to go into the BIOS and advanced setup at boot up. And you can do that when the laptop turns on by pressing F2, that will take you into the BIOS setup. Then I believe you use the arrows to go to advanced setup and switch the uh, function key, multimedia key options there and set them how you like. But this is the simplest way I found to fix it on my Dell laptop. So like I said, if um, it's not working for you, man, try function and escape and hopefully that fixes it for you. If not, uh, you might have to go through the BIOS option or something like that. And um, if that helps you guys out, make sure to sub, make sure to check out some of the other videos on the channel, show some support, and I'll see you guys next time. All right, peace.